<laughs> hey guys, it's Joshua Schmidt here giving you the mirror deck profile. Um, we tried this new mirror leader, or well, Alex has mainly. Thank you for always giving me your decks, mate. Um, but yeah, so mirror, he's a self awakening black leader. <laughs> Um, which gives himself 5k and places the top three cards of his deck into the life. Um, also, when you're at four or less, you may choose up to two of your energy and switch to active mode. All right, it's gone. It's back. Um, and then on this side, you can choose up to three cards of your warp and add it to um, add it to your drop, and then gains 5k. So it's we mainly play this rush. The reason why I play it rush is because it's probably the only way you really meant to just play this deck. You don't play, you know, the, the cell chain combo. If you want to play it, you play it with the other leader. Um, we play four of the Supreme Kai, because that's the only um, super combo we can play. And we play yellow, because yellow is just really good. Play four Roshis. Um, with the other deck profile, we're playing three. This is better with four, because you kind of just need to survive till turn five. Play four Youthful Bulma. Youthful Bulma, of course, you're getting your one drop draws. Two Bad Ring and four Flying Nimbus. Um, I, I like I really like this ratio pretty much just in any yellow deck right now if you have the two spots You should always just chuck two yellow uh, bad ring lasers in there because it really just stops opponents from like Being able to get away with like good shenanigans and all that Play four time control Kronoa because we don't like Shagesh um, like in some cases like it being 3k actually really does matter i found that like a lot of the time i'm just piping down carvers with this or carvers and trunks and gohans but um it's still okay you can swing with your leader for it play four planet vegeta i know we are playing the mo monkey package but you may be searching all your saiyans so like your, your trunks and your bardocks play four gravy yes gravy and it was four this time um, when you combo with this, you get to place two of your cards from your warp back into your drop. And, um, yeah, that's mainly the reason why you play it. It's not always a good two drop, but if you need a two drop, you can just swing it for two. Uh, for 15. Um, and four time, like, we found this one's better than Trunks in most cases, because, like, I know Trunks, you don't show your opponent, and, like, you can add a negate. But with the way the format is right now, <laughs> the, the way the format is right now, you'd probably just be better off going with more options than less. And then uh, play four times judgment. Um, this can be really good at in some cases. There's some cases where we've added back like this just to get that extra negate in because of like the way the format has turned. But yeah. Four, Awakened Warrior Bardock. Warping this thing out and giving it double strike was always great by itself. But the main reason why you want to play it is for the uh, Super Saiyan 3 Bardock, which is mainly why you want to, like, why this deck is good. Your lead is black, you're an aggro deck, you can push as much damage as you want, um, and then just warp off their whole board and then swing for triple strike 30k. Um, and play four trunks over power over the same time to add back your super combos. And of course, your SCR Demogra, because this thing just destroys lives. That's it for the deck profile, guys. Um, I'll see you in the next one. <laughs> right.